I heard you put an end to the smugglers' trafficking, Mr. Manser. I am disappointed. Why is that? My concern? Oh no, I simply admired the man. Not for the income he scraped from his beggar army, but rather for the pressure he managed to put on the merchants without lifting a finger. With that said, anything having to do with crime is my concern. Maybe you will remember the next time before you stick your fingers in my pies. Now tell me, what do you want? I'm looking for a prostitute named Sarah. Hmm. And you wouldn't be the only one. She was quite the popular menu item for the boys at the barracks, until she disappeared, like a puff of once lucrative smoke. You catch wind of her, you'll let me know. I'd be much obliged. Wish I could give you a bearing, but the truth of the matter is, the doll simply disappeared, along with a potential prophet I'm not happy to have seen go with her, but would pay to see returned, with or without some added bruising as a lesson in running off. I just wanted you to know my services are available for a price. Hmm, interesting. A question, though. Is it really the pay you're after, Manser, or could it be the adrenaline? Those old graybeards at the source boring the living hell out of you yet? I don't remember inviting you into my business. If you need me, just pay. A technomancer for hire. A prize indeed. Who wouldn't need such a thing? But you'll need to... Prove yourself first. The army has a weapon shipment heading to the front. I'd like for it to not get there. Why don't you use your rank to see that it makes an unforeseen detour to, well, me? This a test of loyalty? Fine, if that's what you need. I gotta go. Then go. Those mutants refused to climb onto the roof to fix it! Just when I thought I'd seen everything, now we get rejected by those... things? Unbelievable. We could die roasting in the sun, yet no one can command those lazy abominations. Someone needs to teach them a lesson. Hopefully soon, those creatures are out of line. Don't worry. The Dowser will send men to whip those bastards in shape. So you find my girl yet? Popular young girl you got there. Word is the mob's looking for her too, but she slipped away. Maybe one of her regular clients could help. Oh, well let me think. There was one fella was deep into my cell, if you catch my drift. Spent all his serum, time, attention on my baby girl. John. John Labor, I believe. Fella from the slums, but if you're gonna find him there, you have to go at day's end. During daylight, the boy works round them military warehouses with the rovers. find the girl's client at this hour. Probably working. I'll just come back later tonight.
a way I'm gonna find the girl's client at this hour. Probably working. I'll just come back later tonight. Hey, you John Labor? That depends. What's this about? You all right? Look a little worse for wear. Oh yeah, never better. What do you want? A young woman worked around here. Name was Sarah. The girl's gotten popular. A lot of people looking for her these days. What's it to you? Just a guy trying to help her out. What do you say? Yeah. Yeah, all right. That girl could use all the help she could get. Now, I, I tried. I, I tried not to tell him where she was at, but a fella can only take so much before he breaks. You follow? A fella can only take so much. Sarah wanted out. Out of her family, away from a bitch mother, out of the city, away from the underworld, out of abundance. It's a world of hope is all. A new start. Is that too much to want? No. So she headed off to the exchange to find a smuggler. Or anyone offering hope. But... Thanks to me, she probably got those assholes all over her by now. I try to keep my mouth shut. Y'all really try. You gotta go get her first, mister. She's a good girl. So go on now. You find her, and you help her. What are you doing here, huh? What do you want? Nothing from you. I'm here for... Gal? Great. Sorry she's ours. You can come back later after we're done with her. You can get the hell out now and never come back! Or do you need me to help you out permanently? Please! Please, sir! Shut your fucking mouth, bitch! Fuck your lucky damaged goods are worth less, or I'd drop a hammer on your teeth! Yeah, I think we've got a little misunderstanding. I need to talk to the girl, and you don't really have a choice here. <laughs> Is that so? <laughs> If 
you really want to leave, nah, I know a traveling merchant who may be willing to help you. He's in the exchange quarter and he owes me a favor or two. Tell him I sent you. It'll be a lot safer than trying to find an honest smuggler. Really? Why? Thank you. Thank you. I will never forget you. Tom complaining again the other day. Vori raised their tax again. Again? This is absurd. They already have this. Hey there, Fiorello. Ah, the one, the only, Sakurai Mansur. A pleasure as always. What brings you here this fine morning? I see they got you the mutant. Yes, yes, a wonderful specimen. Words and all. Bag! Mutant! Called Bag! Beautiful! Yes, Bag! And his sheer size. Like he was simply built to dissuade any ill-intentioned folks from bothering us. Here, here, take this. To compensate you for all you've done. And feel free, any time, to request any favor in return. I need your help. And I haven't forgotten I owe you. I'm happy to help wherever I can. Glad to hear it. I'd like you to take this young woman with you. Her name's Sarah. Of course, I'd be happy to. If she wants to leave, I'm sure her reasons are more than valid, so I won't pry. You can count on me. Thank you. Nice 
Batman, help Bag, please? Bag soon leave with Master Merchant. Bag need help, Man Lightning. I, I guess that I can bring the stone. Yes, it's a very nice drawing that you made. Yes, Man Lightning, nice. Give Master to Bag. Bag have memory for Mother. Make himself. You go give memory to Mother Bag. Ah, uh, is it me you're calling, Man Lightning? Man, nice. Man, very nice. Where are you from, Beg? Have you worked in the pen for a long time? <laughs> Beg, not no. Several, many nights. Hmm. It's not gonna be easy to get anything from him. Goodbye, Beg. Goodbye. Sorry if this is out of line, Lieutenant, but why the hell are we helping the mutant? Seems like a waste of time. Something the captain might not. Because I said so. It won't take long. Hi, you Jenny Labor? Yeah, that's me. What can I do for you? Nothing for me. A mutant named Beg sent me to give you something. A souvenir, or... I don't know. It's just a stone that he drew on. Thank you. Oh, my dear little... Corporation. Have all the bigwigs gone crazy? That poor woman has resorted to eating a stone just to get away from the ASC. This is completely insane. Who are we gonna tell the mutant? We're gonna tell him his mother's dead. Unless you've got a better idea. Yeah! <laughs> 
The opponents of the assembly are becoming more and more numerous and more and more reckless. I heard they become so ballsy that they're planning to blow stuff up. Hello, Beg. Oh, hello! Man, have orders for Beg? I... I'm sorry, Beg. I gave your stone to your mother, but she died. I... I believe that she committed suicide because the police were about to arrest her. She put the stone in her mouth and died. Mother? Mother dead? No! Uh, I'm really sorry. I didn't think that she would do such a thing. <laughs> 